I thank all of you uh, for coming out, the business people, the nonprofits, and others who are concerned. Uh, you've come out today uh, with an interest in investing in Haiti. It's about long term investment in a country that has been uh, devastated but is on its way with your support to a sustained recovery. The people of Haiti, the country of Haiti, folks that we saw on TV, the devastation, the pictures, the real life tragedies, far, far away, but ever so close because of the strong Haitian community here in Philadelphia, still struggling with basic needs, from housing to food to medical supplies each and every day. And when the disaster struck Haiti, there was an outpouring of donations from around the world, but certainly by the United States and from the good people of Philadelphia. But I want to be very clear here this morning. That outpouring of support cannot stop. And of course, uh, in a 24-hour, seven-day-a-week news cycle, the media is unfortunately often distracted by other events and activities that may certainly be of equal importance. We cannot allow ourselves to be distracted, and much attention, of course, is now devoted to the tragedy going on in the Gulf. That does not mean that things have suddenly, instantly, miraculously gotten better in Haiti. So whether or not the images and pictures are on TV each and every day or not, we know from reports on the ground that there's still much work to be done. The future of Haiti and the needs of the Haitian people shift because of some of those issues and support. They may shift from the requirements of the day to day, but now we need to talk about long-term investments and reconstruction and economic development. By investing in Haiti today, it will help ensure the country's economic recovery and viability for decades to come. The World Trade Center, Greater Philadelphia, and the U.S. Department of Commerce understand the importance of encouraging businesses to come out and learn about opportunities for investment. And so I want to commend you, both organizations, for providing this forum in Philadelphia and forums in Washington, D.C., Miami, Florida, and of course, New York City. By doing this, you will stimulate interest across the country and around the world for the opportunities for economic development and strategic investments to start this great country on the path to a long-term, sustainable recovery. I want to thank the members of the Haitian uh, diaspora who came out this morning as well. Philadelphia has a strong Haitian community. We have many ties that bind us together, and our ties run very, very deep. Would you please recognize the Haitian community that is here with us? The Haitian professionals of Philadelphia, and as I mentioned earlier, the Mayor's Commission on African and Caribbean Affairs, I have worked very, very closely to provide an advocacy, especially for those who have been displaced, family members who are here in the United States, but who, who have family all abroad. And they have strongly, and actively, and I would suggest appropriately, aggressively uh, advocated for help and support here in Philadelphia. The Salvation Army of Greater Philadelphia has helped food drives. The Red Cross of Southeastern Pennsylvania has offered medical supplies and logistical support that virtually started almost from day one. The Philadelphia region has been intimately involved in helping Haiti to get back on its feet and keep the attention where it needs to be and focused, coordinating efforts, making sure that literally we're all not stumbling over each other in an effort and an outpouring of the American spirit to offer support and assistance. This was a natural disaster. It does not mean that humans can't do something about it. This forum is one way to provide opportunity for help. Business growth and business development, whether here in Philadelphia, thousands of miles away in Haiti, is all a part of our local, regional, national, and economic efforts to recover, but also to invest wisely. An investment in Haiti is a wise investment. But more importantly, an investment in Haiti is the right thing to do. It's the moral thing to do. It's the American thing to do. And so I urge you to listen very closely. There'll be a ton of information given out and a lot of good context that can be made here. I appreciate all of your commitment and all of your support and all of your interest. But what I appreciate most is that you're demonstrating right here at this forum 
what America is all about. America is about its people and people all around the world who love freedom, respect democracy, and love their nation. Thank you for participating.